we'll show you also some of the um, important aspects, some of the features of the pinpointer mode. Here, this is your ground balance. You can affect the sensitivity or change the sensitivity here with this range. So you can go from plus 10 to minus 10. Obviously, minus 10 is it's only going to react to super strong targets. Plus 10 is it's going to react to very minimal changes. So this is um, uh, going to show you very subtle changes in the, in the field that it's measuring. So this is a very good uh, scale to use when you want to, and you can see how it straightens up to green when I move it back to zero. And with your ground balance, you always want to, to do your intermediate um, ground balances. If you get into a situation where you have shifted or rotated the the device you always want to go back to your ground balance to recenter everything so this is the exp 7000 in pinpointer mode another quick point to to note is you see we've only got the single super sensor for pinpointer mode mineral scan mode you only use the center sensor you don't need the extenders so that's a, an important thing to think about when you're setting up your process, setting up which steps you want to do first, um, you always, you know, I don't like to spend time putting the sensors on, taking them off, putting them on, taking them off, and I know you don't either. So whenever you're thinking about the the steps in which you're going to do your analysis, always consider that the pinpointer mode only uses the center sensor. <laughs>